what is up welcome to another video and i know my beard is getting out of control but um, i'm trying to tame it uh yeah this video we are talking about bcis again brain computer interfaces but i have a really really cool new thing over here which is called the next mind device really amazing i'm gonna show some demos later on but yeah with this device and the sensors over here you are able to basically sense your brain activity and yeah it's really really cool so don't miss this video so if you have no idea about bcis or brain computer interfaces then definitely check out the last video on this topic of course i will link it in the description below or in the card up where you will find it no worries and yeah let's actually talk about this awesome device so this here is the next mind dev kit let me see if you can actually see it. Yeah, now we have some good lighting. There we go. So this is the De Next Mind Dev Kit, and it allows you to basically detect the electrical signals that get sent from your brain. And yeah, I just showed my the back of my brain because this is where the visual cortex is actually located. And with the device, you can actually detect if you are looking at some specific patterns, which I will come to later on as well. And yeah, with that in mind, mind, you can actually um, fire events, which then means if you are able to de detect those things, you can create custom apps, games, interfaces. You can even like control your lights with your brain. Literally, it's uh, possible, which is pretty cool. And yeah, infinite amount of new opportunities again as a developer because um, it's, they have a very, very good SDK as well, a Unity SDK and you can yeah, do whatever you want to. You just need to connect the device with any computer via Bluetooth and then yeah, the information is synced and then you can yeah, hook up all the events and do all the applications you want to do. The cool thing is yeah, you basically take the um, device over here and then the band, there we go. Now it's um, there and let me just see if it's on the right side. There we go. And you comb it a little bit just like this and then yeah start doing some awesome mind games basically so let's yeah go back there check out some cool demos and later on check out a vr demo as well so let's check out the next map manager uh, we have here on the left side we have the setup and calibrate i've connected it already because you don't need to see how i'm connecting a bluetooth device so just right here and then yeah you basically see i have it strapped on my head like this and the back side is and the sensors are on the back of my head since um there's yeah the visual cortex and let's just see how the connection is and it's perfect of course uh, there we go and now yeah i have to do the calibration i will just fast forward it because yeah it's kind of like boring to watch the whole calibration but let's go and let me focus here Whew, that was full focus, guys. Let's see how smart I actually am. Come on. And. Okay, it's taking some time. Three. Well, <laughs> I'm not too dumb, so <laughs> that's fine. <clears throat> I've pre prepared a little game for you guys. So. Now. Uh, just for the testing, it tells us to yeah, test your calibration by focusing on the discs. And if I just like now look at the middle disc, let me just see. And there we go. Of course, I could be cheating. This is why I have prepared a little bowl. And yeah, it will basically tell us if we have to go in the left, right, or middle. Let me just shake it up. And now take a random one. I don't even see anything here. So you guys will see it first. Damn it. It is, well, it looks like an L. So the left one, I keep my hands here and left. Oh, let's do one more. This one. What does it say? Right hands and let's check the right one there we go just using my brain 
So let's now check out some demos that we have here. As we can see, we have three here and then three demos here. And then in the end, yeah, we have an SDK and a documentation for Unity. And basically, yeah, those are the apps. Let's just start with this one now, Nero TV. And in here, yeah, we can watch TV with your, our brains or we can select the TV things. So let's start and I'm watching there. There we go. In my hands just for you guys. Let's watch the news. Oh, that's, that's a bit loud. There we go. So now I can pause if I watch there and just mute for now. And now pause. Awesome. And now let's just watch. Uh, let's see what else we have. Uh -huh. Let's watch kids TV. Oh, I love this show. I love it. We can actually watch it. No, just kidding. Let's let's actually go back. I think uh, if we want to exit, uh, to be honest, let's see, go to main menu. There we go. Yeah, pretty cool, right? The cool thing is, yeah, for other examples like the platformer, we can actually also use um, our keyboard. So it's not only like the brain control, it is, um, yeah, we can jump basically like every platformer, but now we have to focus to move this thing. And there we go. And if I stop looking at it, oh, let me actually destroy this one first before it kills me. Shit. Ah, whew. no, yeah, pretty cool. Die. Damn it, I stopped watching. <gasps> nice. <sighs> for the last demo for this video, of course, if you want to have more demos or more videos on those topics, then just let me know in the comments below so I can better adjust on yeah what kind of content we, you guys see on this channel. Let's check out, yeah, learn more about Nextmind technology. I think, yeah, I mean, Brick Breaker, let's just uh, check it out for a couple of seconds. Pretty cool, like you can just move your, this kind of thing, oh, like, like this, and yeah, play Brick Breaker. <laughs> let's check out the showroom. Uh, what we should we check out first? Let's go from the top left. Wireless sensing. Mm -hmm. There we go. Can I actually interact with this one or it just tells us uh, what we can do here? <clears throat> High end technology. Is there some more information? Yes, there is. Oh, that's fancy. So what do we have here? We have the battery, Bluetooth transmission, uh, onboard processing, and yeah, signal acquisition. So those little knobs that I have basically on my scalp were in play. Yeah, that's pretty cool. You can actually, uh, which I'm gonna do later on as well, um, put those things uh, on the quest as well, because you can just, yeah, strap it on here as well. You can also just put it on a base cap or anything like this, and that's pretty nice. Non-invasive sensor. Yeah, basically you don't have to make a hole in your brain like with Neuralink, for example, or any other invasive surgery needed. You just put it on and if you don't want it anymore, you just put it off. And then, yeah, long battery life. Let's see what they have there. Well, yeah, USB-C connection loading. Very nice renderings here. Good job, guys. Okay. Yeah, and of course here some documentation, which is pretty nice because you can actually um, see the events that are fired. I mean, like that's now we are getting into more development stuff and that's really cool. So now like if I look at it, it um, can do any kind of basic thing. So here we see the event that's being triggered and all of those things. Let me just jump through. So now we can animate things as well, of course fancy things like this and now we can um yeah select we have the had the demo already um yeah kind of toggle buttons like anything that has an event 
can be triggered with next mind, and that's pretty powerful. Ah. And yeah, basically many, many, many other demos. Like here, this is pretty cool. You, you can like select the zone. Let me just go the right one. Boom. And so many other things. I mean, like I should not go into detail on all of those because it will just, yeah, blow up the video length, but pretty nice and very helpful if you are a developer and you want to build some cool things with Nextmind. But now let's check out the VR demo. Let me just, um, yeah, build it up real quick and I will be back in a second. Let's go. Bam! This is blowing your mind. Okay, that's pretty cool. Yeah, if I start talking, oh, they don't die anymore because I'm not focused enough. It's not too easy. Yeah, now it's confirmed. <laughs> okay, I mean, that's of course just like the training. This guy looks so well, much well, like Portal. You can check your performance on the panel. Oh. Brain power 25%. Thanks for the compliment. Oh, no. oh shit. We are under attack. We detected Xenos. You need to run away. Focus on the light for Xenos. They are already on the rescue. They will capture you. Okay, let's see what's going on now. Hello, thank you very much. Oh, oh. This is Colonel Shepard speaking. You are on planet Victoria. The Xenos have captured you during your escape. I'll guide you to the extraction point, where we'll pick you up, if you're still alive. Oh, that guy. Okay. I've activated a neuro-teleporter. You... Ah. What's going on? I forgot to turn off the alarm. Well, it's going to be tougher than expected. Oh shit, you our must enemies. Fight back and dodge their energy blasts. Oh shit. How am I supposed to dodge? I cannot walk around. <laughs> I'm on this cable now, but I will do my best. Let's see. Oh god. Die! Die! Cool environment, by the way. It really <laughs> reminds me of Portal, which is, a, a, which is a good thing, because I love this game so much. I think that's actually one of my first let's plays. Yeah. Uh oh. That was the last one. Teleport to the extraction area. Let's go. Oh, it's this looks. Reminder. He's preventing us from landing. This looks you like an end boss. Now he has three brains. Now we only need to shot. Use the teleporters to reach the other brains while this one is down. Only two more to go. Come on. Come on. Oh man, I'm too good. Come on. Finish him. Come on. Man. Nice job. You did it. Talking about brain muscles. Let's see. If anyone beats the score, you guys will get a shout out. Hit six penalties. Okay, not sure what that's supposed to mean, but I'm pretty happy with the result. Cool! Ugh, I have it way too tight. That's kind of like invasing already. Ah, there we go. Really cool. So yeah, really, really amazing device. Next mind. And yeah, as you can see here already, that's the website. The SDK is um, publicly available already. Again, thanks for the next one team for sending me this device to test it out. And for you guys watching the video, if you want me to um, make some cool apps or games with this one with my control, then definitely let me just know. And yeah, if you have a cool idea, then just um, tell us in the comments. And if that's a really cool idea that is um, kind of like doable, 
I will make it and I will teach you how to do it. And yeah, so the product, if we just check it out, it's actually quite affordable. Uh, it starts here, we see the uh, $3.99 and I think the shipping is worldwide. And that's basically all you need. You just have this device and um, well, the strap over here and that's all of it. So yeah, amazing thing. Really cool to see something like this already. And um, really looking forward to what this um, whole brain computer interface technology can offer in the future as well. Yeah, it's an amazing time to be alive, definitely. And yeah, thank you so much for listening. If you have any questions, as always, leave them in the comments below. If you want to um, yeah, meet some amazing, awesome, like-minded people, check out our Discord community. It's totally free, so there's nothing to lose. And as always, I see you in the next one.